Hey guys, Casey Ashmore, Austin Klesenberry. So, a couple things. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays, Happy Hanukkah, blessings to all of you and your families. We are wrapping up a long, a long week, even though it's a three-day week and it's leading into, there's only eight days left in the year and, you know, next week will be even shorter because it's, you know, New Year's and... Wanted to pass on, you know, a Christmas blessing we we got and we were able to provide. So, twice in the last 60 days, we've been approached by clients who have been on the eve of trial and in a scenario where their their case, no matter what it was, you know, family, probate, criminal, whatever it had, it had gone on for a for a length of time, you know, and for one reason or another, they were no longer able to afford their first trial counsel. So litigation fatigue, uh, you know, you've seen me do videos about it. It's, it's because you just cannot afford for another continuance and another round of questions and answers and discoveries and depositions. And, and that, you know, as a case goes from year one to year two, to sometimes into year three, that that fatigue can be very, very real. And we were approached by these two clients and we were able to, you know, to have the gift of representing them and and also to have a, you know, meritorious claims and defenses in, in these two separate cases and more importantly, offer a solution. And instead of walking up to the line of scrimmage and calling a timeout and punting the football with a continuance or regrouping. Let's file a motion to continue so I can get up to speed on the case so Austin can help me go through all the files and we can get our hands on what we've got in front of us. Instead, you just walk up to the line of scrimmage and, you know, kind of goes back to, even though I'm a, I'm a Cowboys fan, you know, Nick Foles, number one starter goes down. NFC playoffs, Nick Foles comes in, walks up to the line of scrimmage, calls an audible, and, and he's a Super Bowl MVP. And I'm not saying that happened. If nothing's ever perfect in, in litigation because, because it's not fair, right? I, I, y'all, If you've heard me say it once, I've said it a thousand times. Fair is what happens in Dallas in the fall, except for this year. So what you get in court is reasonable. And what we were able to do is get our clients a reasonable result, right? Where you know, the chips are going to be, where they, the facts are already done, the discovery is what it is, the, the case is postured as it is. You're just talking about walking down, lifting up the ropes, stepping into the ring, and going for it, right? Being, being there and being ready. Right. Being there, being ready. And offering a solution, right, that, that brings some finality. There's nothing... Uh, although there is the, the the courts of appeals, right? But the, but for the most part, a final trial on the merits is finality in a case, and so that was a gift we were given to be able to give those uh, Christmas blessings, if you were, to to our clients and to have that opportunity. And uh, I just want to say thank you all for supporting us. Thank you all who who you know who are viewers who support us and allow us to serve this North Texas community. And we will see you guys. Merry Christmas. And thank you again. God bless America. Happy holidays, y'all. All right. No outtakes. <laughs>